Hi guys, today's reading is going to be a love message. We're going to take a look and see what messages are coming up for you at this particular point in time. It is going to be a general reading, guys, so please keep that in mind. If you are after personal reading, feel free to reach out and inquire. Email is going to be listed below the video. Um, okay, so you've got a bit of fire in the energies. Um, the magician's energy, you're definitely manifesting something or someone here. And the universe is basically asking you to be as specific as you can. Um, if, you, if you have a certain person in mind, uh, or if you're trying to attract like a date with a person, um, it just feels like you're putting the intention out there um, and you're staying open. And it does feel like your manifestations are going to show up here. So someone might show up in, in your life very quickly. You may actually hear from someone if that is what you're manifesting, to hear from someone or to hear back from someone, especially with the presence of the Queen of Swords. But whatever it is that you're really focused on manifesting and attracting, it feels like this is going to show up in your life very quickly. The suit of wands is a very fast moving energy. Whenever the magician shows up, he's always a resounding yes. So if you've been thinking about something lately, if you've got a if you've had like a question looping around in your mind, um, or if you have a question as we do this reading. The magician is basically an affirmation. It's telling me that the answer to your question is yes. So if you've been wondering whether you're going to hear from your person, uh, the answer is yes. Or if you're going to see them or you'll be catching up with them soon, yes to those questions. Um, so yeah, it's important for you to stay really focused and be as specific as you can with your details. Because you're in a very powerful manifesting mode and your energy feels like it's very open um, to receiving. It's very open to blessings and abundance. So be as specific, be as detailed as you can. Um, if there's any questions that you want to ask your person or if you want to ask your person out or if you want to make a move or if you want to tell your person how you feel, now's a really good time to do that. Now's a really good time to maybe clear the air, um, you know, shoot your shot, make your move, ask any questions here that you've been wanting to ask. Um, there is... There is something here that I feel like maybe your person also wants to ask you. Maybe this is someone who has a crush on you and wants to ask you out, wants to take you out, wants to get to know you. I feel like there's also some sort of upcoming event that you're going to be attending or you're going to be invited to. Now, I feel like your person may be, your person may be organizing like a special date for you, maybe taking you out to some place very special and it's going to be very memorable and I think you potentially could end up like solidifying and um, solidifying the connection uh, or maybe opening up yourselves to one another um, opening up your hearts to each other here or if you're single and you're showing up to this event it's very likely that you might meet someone here someone whom you're going to have very strong and almost instant chemistry with so especially if it's like some sort of milestone event, like a, um, a celebration, a wedding, a birthday or a graduation of some sort or some sort of work event, something on like a bigger scale, it feels like you potentially could be attracting um, maybe even more than one uh, admirer here. Someone who is going to, I feel like this person is going to approach you this person is going to show up very confident so it's important that you show up confident as well so that you can attract the very thing or the very person that you want um 
some of you I feel like there's someone here whom you want to connect with or even reconnect with um, this could be like a flirtationship of some sort or maybe it's someone from your past or maybe it's like a current energy and you guys are sort of you know you're both interested in each other romantically but you're kind of skirting around the fact you're kind of dancing around um, each other and not necessarily being forward or direct about it but it feels like if you kind of give this person a green light it feels like this person may be confident in um, telling you how they feel or confident in asking you out or approaching you or approaching the situation also I feel like stay focused on you stay focused uh, like have fun enjoy yourself keep doing you keep doing what it is that you're doing and I definitely feel like your manifestations and your intentions are going to be showing up. You know, it's like love freely and you'll be loved back. Um, focus on yourself, focus on what matters. If someone asks you out, it's probably um, su it's suggested here in the cards that it may be a good idea to say yes, even if this person isn't exactly your type. Um, why not give it a shot because you never know you know G give it a chance give it a shot because you never know what this could be or where it could lead uh, to um, if you're already in a relationship it feels like your relationship or your connection with this person does have room for growth um, so be open to just having fun be open to new experiences um, it feels like right now you're making new connections very effortlessly and very easily um, if some of you are looking for love then I do think that there is someone here who is going to show up in your life um, someone who you're going to connect with very easily it could be look this energy could be like um, a situation ship or it could start off as a casual casual arrangement However, I do think that there is an energy or a chemistry there between the both of you that will allow you to connect with this person on a more deeper level. You're definitely feeling a sense of entanglement with someone here. Um, whether this is someone new that's showing up or someone who is already in your life um, or someone from the past, there's definitely some sort of entanglement that I'm seeing for you. Choose, I feel like if you're in doubt here, choose love is the message that I'm getting for you. I'm seeing that like love relationships and connections are going to be taking up a lot of your time. Um, Open communication is going to foster a deeper relationship or a deeper co connection with someone here. Okay, so emotional clarity um, or focus on any opportunities that allow you to open up and allow you to express yourself. Um, I feel like right now is the ideal time for that. So even if you're starting off, you know, with someone new, it may be, an ideal it, it may be a good time to let this person know from the very beginning what you expect from out of this you know relationship or connection whether you want something long term or whether you want something just um something casual um i feel like vulnerability when it comes to this person or when it comes to connecting with someone new i feel like vulnerability is definitely your strength and it's definitely going to be the energy that I feel like is going to attract the right person. Um, sharing, you, you know, sharing your true feelings and sharing your true intentions, I think is going to lead to a very special and a very profound bonding with this person. Um, 
I'm also seeing that there is some sort of event here, which I think has a lot to do with the event that you're that we spoke about earlier. I feel like it's going to there's something it's like it could be only a small thing or a small gesture, but I feel like it's going to turn into a very meaningful moment for you. So stay open to any new experiences, um, connecting with any new people or even reconnecting with people from the past. Um, yeah, stay open. Stay open and pay attention to how, you know, how people make you feel. I feel like the energies are all about socializing. They're all about having fun, enjoying yourself, enjoying new experiences, putting yourself out there. I feel like whoever this person is that's showing in, showing up in your life or is about to show up in your life or has recently shown up in your life is going to take you on an incredible adventure of intimacy, of romance. Um, it's it's not the kind of adventure where you, you're going to be traveling together although that might happen but I feel like it's one where this person is going to like take your heart in an adventure right um you're going to let your walls come down with this person and I think that whether this person stays in your life for the long term or whether this person is just a brief chapter I feel like they're going to transform your life in a very divine way and I think it's going to this going this is going to be a very profound connection and a very memorable one as well. Um, there potentially could be discussions or conversations around deep commitment. Um, and remember, I mean whether you're just starting out in this relationship or whether you're already, you know, um, deep in the relationship remember that you have the power to create to create and attract uh, the relationship that most aligns with you so don't hold yourself back don't let any fears hold you uh, hold you back from making each moment memorable from making each moment you know an adventurous one Alright guys, and these are your messages. Thank you for watching and listening. Please show your support to the channel by liking, sharing and subscribing. Bye for now.